I'm full trained architect and uh, my adventure with flying uh, began in the same, the same moment when uh, I started to study architecture. It was in 1996 and after four years of working in studio with my father, who is also an architect, I realized that this is not my first passion no more. And you know what? I realized that my first passion is flying and I wanted to be up there in under the clouds then with my colleagues in the studio i fly on paraglider i uh, drive this paraglider by uh, my own and five years ago i started with a gyroplane it's crazy mix between a helicopter and a plane like a flying motorcycle and it's it is much easier to me to fly by my own than to explain to somebody else uh, what i want to do and what effect I, uh, I want to take. And uh, while I'm, I'm flying, I can see the ground. I know where those pictures have been taken, but sometimes I'm not quite sure what they are and what uh, those situations are. We leave traces on the ground, we the people. And uh, I was wondering whole life, uh, and I was sure that the forest that I can see in front of my window is the natural virgin true forest. And right now I'm not sure because perhaps it's just the timber cultivation, which is very close to potato field, but it's much more complicated in the in richness of forms. But this is just the industrial uh, of timber. What does that mean, human natural environment? Is it untouched before we came? and we change this landscape? Or is it uh, changed for our needs? And I don't want to evaluate those pictures. And I don't want to name those pictures. I don't want to caption them because I would like to leave those pictures for interpretation. I want to take my audience with me. And I would like to give them the chance to understand the landscape by their own like they would be my passengers. They can see the landscape and they can think, uh, what is this and, and what does what that mean? I think that I'm a hostage of my pictures and of my education. And uh, I think that uh, uh, because uh, I, I look for very harmonic and formal uh, places to be taken from above. And my pictures are very harmonic because I use language of drawing, of drawing, which is architectural language. And I think that I can miss uh, many situations up there in the air because uh, my matrix is formatted in one way. And yeah, that's a feature of me and I feel good with it.